What's up, team? Um, as you know, YouTube gives out play buttons for certain benchmarks when you hit, uh, you know, they get 100,000 subscribers, you get a silver play button. Um, One million subscribers, you get a gold play button. Um, but since we're like a science channel and we do things a little bit differently, you know, and I've always kind of just, you know, done things a little bit differently, we're going to award ourselves with the most explosive play button ever. Okay, so you're probably thinking, what makes the most explosive play button ever? Well, as you can see, there's kind of a theme in the play buttons. You know, we have a silver, we have a gold. I thought about that, I was like, you know what? Like, if I just stick with the, the whole metal theme, you know, what if we get a metal, but a really explosive metal? And I started thinking, remember when we did the video with the potassium and we did it with Smosh and that was really cool? And I was like, what about sodium? You know, we haven't done anything with sodium. What about pure sodium metal? So I went ahead and bought one pound of pure sodium metal. And so I'm gonna go ahead and create the play button out of our sodium metal. And I'm gonna frame it right here in our little shadow box. I'm gonna add the appropriate language. Congratulations on the most explosive play button ever. And uh, that's gonna require some interesting configuration because you can't just mount the sodium. Um, it's reactive even with the moisture that's in the air. It'll actually like catch on fire and like sparks go everywhere. And I don't want that. I don't want that inside of this. So what we're gonna have to do is actually we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to create almost like a, like a little fish tank filled with mineral oil, which is what comes in the container actually here so it doesn't burst into flames. I got some mineral oil right here. And so I have some plexiglass. We're gonna basically create like a little, uh, like a little aquarium for our little play button so it sits nicely. And then we're gonna test how explosive our play button is. And we're gonna go out to an offsite location, not my kitchen, not the Nicopedia lab kitchen. And uh, we're gonna test how explosive the most explosive play button ever, ever is. Ever. Explosive. Okay, so I don't have a color printer. And so we really had to mastermind coming up with making this YouTube. Um, I started actually just cutting out the, the white tube with a scalpel and um, these scissors. I got pretty far. <laughs> it's actually not bad. I might even <laughs> come back around to that. But we also have this over here. Uh, my ingenious cameraman. Really good with Photoshop. So we printed that off. This paper right here. I'm coloring it in with colored pencil. So there we go. There's our YouTube. <laughs> I like it. I think it's pretty good. Here we go. Nickypedia, congratulations on it. Most explosive. It was gonna say play, play button ever, but it was a lot of work to put it all out there. Plus we felt like that was just kind of a little bit cooler because it's kind of like a self-fulfilling prophecy. It's like, congratulations on the most explosive play button ever, of which we were gonna reward you with the most explosive play button ever. <laughs> that makes sense. So we decided the reward is just for being the most explosive. Cause that's, uh, that's what we do, we blow stuff up and we like that. And so here is our play button. Well it's not in there yet, but um, that's the first step. So what we're doing is this, uh, the, the kitchen, the Nickpedia kitchen lab, uh, that was just, we're getting a little too crazy in there. So we decided to come out here to the real Nickpedia lab and um, I'm gonna set this up, I'm putting this, some plastic wrap down so I can put the, uh, our, our pure sodium metal. And with a mallet, I'm gonna hammer it out into our play button, and I'm gonna carve it into our play button, and I'm gonna stick it in some oil. We're gonna go out to the desert, and uh, we're gonna test exactly how explosive that play button is. First step is I have to make it first though, so we need to, we need to do that. Make sure again there's no water up here. like a nice little cutting board. Okie doke. Again there. Bring this insane giant piece of sodium out. And uh, I'm gonna go to work on it. Definitely getting 
the platter. That's good. So what we decided to do instead of carving it, um, is I, I, you know, I'm not the best at making triangles. I uh, decided that uh, you know we're just gonna stick with this whole smashing stuff in, and we decided that we're gonna create a little triangle. Like yeah, I kind of screwed up a little bit, but we'll just connect the dots there. I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of like emboss it. Okay, here we go. There. There is a play button. That is a play button, people. That is the world's most explosive play button ever created. Okay, right there. That's our, our makeshift aquarium made with plexiglass and super glue. There's the most explosive play button ever. in its new home. Look at that, perfect. Right to the top. That's pretty awesome, actually. That's, that's pretty fantastic. I'm really happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> the novelty of it is so rich. This is ready to go in the water. That is that is a perfect. <laughs> Nickopedia, congratulations on the most explosive, just being the most explosive in general. I, I feel like I'm pretty explosive. And so um, I think this award's quite fitting. Thank you, YouTube, for sending me this. <laughs> I'm not even gonna play that up. We 100% made this for ourselves uh, because, you know, subscribers are cool. If you haven't yet hit like and subscribe, <laughs> Everyone does it for subscribers. We just want to be a little bit different. We were thought, we thought, you know, we're going to take like, yeah, the science approach to this and award ourselves for being the most explosive. So the next step is we're going to take us out to the desert and uh, we're going to throw it into uh, a lot of water. And uh, my prediction is it's going to go kaboom. What we have to do now is we have to figure out a mechanism of like a pull pin. So when I actually pull it and let it fall into the water, uh, I'm nowhere near, I'm nowhere to be found. I'm behind like a little blast shield out in the desert. So on the day of actually doing this, we're gonna have a table, we're gonna have some water down here. And line that up properly. And then this is either gonna be, maybe I'll just keep the string as it is. Uh, this is like balloon string, or balloon ribbon really. And what's gonna happen is, is I'm gonna be like as many feet away as I possibly can be. Just. I'm gonna try this out, see how far away I can actually do this. So I'd like to be about this far. I'll be behind the little blast shield right here. And if I can make this work, I'll be a happy camper. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. And then we'll go, whoa. That's great. That's gonna work perfectly. That's our pull pin right there. That is our pull pin device. You guys saw it here first. Uh, so when we're out in the desert, I get to keep all my limbs because I want to come back, you know, as a full intact human. I'm actually really impressed by that. Yeah, Ooh. it's gonna work great. I'm a genius. All right, here we go. Oh my God! <laughs> 